Welcome to Playground Sessions. This video will help guide you through the bootcamp section of Playground. The bootcamp contains video tutorials and practice sessions that help with the development of musicianship and piano fundamentals. Lessons are organized according to level of difficulty such as beginner, intermediate, and coming soon, advanced, and also according to subjects such as keyboard skills, notation, rhythm, and playing by ear. You can choose lessons based on your preference and skill level. You can dive right into notation or rhythm or take a guided tour. The guided tours are arranged in an order that provides a balance of the keyboard skills, notation, rhythm, and playing by ear lessons. When you hold your cursor over a lesson icon, you'll be able to preview the key points that will be covered in that lesson. To download a bootcamp lesson, click on free. The lesson will begin downloading and can be viewed in the download manager in the bottom left corner of the application. When the download is complete, the free button will change to a play button. Press play and you'll instantly be brought to the follow along section of the application. Click on play to begin the lesson. The play button then becomes a pause button. So far, you've learned a lot about chords. You've learned about major and minor thirds, major and minor triads, inversions, broken chords, and block chords. So now I want to introduce a new concept, chord symbols. If the bootcamp lesson that you selected also contains music notation, you'll see that displayed on the screen. Now the left-hand portion for this section of the song only walks down one key at a time. And you'll notice that as I demonstrate both hands together. I'll walk through this, the left hand starts first. Now it's gonna walk down to the E. Next on the left is the D. And then we're gonna finish here on the C. The control functions are similar to the song lessons. You can adjust the volume, use the rewind five button to quickly review the last five seconds of the video. You can restart the video from the beginning by using the rewind button, drag the cursor to select a certain start point, and adjust the location of the windows to your preference. If you wanna practice the material covered, you can select the practice mode. The practice mode aids in the learning process by providing you with real-time feedback, scoring, and progress reports. Similar to practice mode in the song lessons, you can adjust the settings to your specifications. You can adjust the tempo to suit your capability, the normal tempo will be the default, or you can choose the slow tempo to work on difficult sections. To help you keep the rhythm, you can play with the metronome. A metronome is a steady click that's in tempo with the song. If you want to have the section repeat multiple times, you can engage the looping function, and that section or the highlighted measures will repeat continuously. After the count in, the notes that you play correctly will turn green, the notes that you play incorrectly will turn red, and notes that are close will turn pink. When you're finished, a results window will appear that will provide more information on percentage of perfect notes, close notes, and wrong notes, playground points, and total points. The arrows will indicate how this session compares to your previous session. You can also share your results on Facebook and Twitter. And you can click on See More Detail to view specific information about your performance over time. This feature is covered in more detail in the dashboard and progress video. I hope you found this video helpful. In order to take full advantage of Playground Sessions, please view the videos for the song library, dashboard in progress, and setup.